Somebody worship that beautiful name this day. Somebody lift up your hands and worship that beautiful name. Somebody come on, worship that beautiful name. The name above every other name. The name is so sweet, sweeter than honey. Come on, somebody begin to bless his name. What a beautiful name it is. And nothing compares to this. What a beautiful name it is. The name of Jesus. You can join me and sing. You were the God. You were the one under the king. One wicked God. Yes, we worship you, Lord. Yeah. Your hidden glory, your It is now revealed in you, our Christ. Come on, somebody. What a beautiful name. What a beautiful name, Jesus. The name of Jesus. Yeah, my. What a beautiful name, oh God. What a beautiful name. Nothing compares to this, yeah. What a beautiful name, Lord. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, one more time, sing. What a beautiful name. What a beautiful name. What a beautiful name. The name of Jesus. The name of Jesus. The name of Jesus. More than conqueror. More than what we can never think of, Lord. Nothing compares. Father, closest friend, most beautiful, yes you are, most beautiful, dearest Father, God bless your name Lord, closest friend, most beautiful, most beautiful, dearest Father, dearest Father, you are my closest friend. Closest friend. Your name is beautiful. Most beautiful. Your name is beautiful. Most beautiful. Your name is beautiful. We call you dearest Father. Dearest Father, you are my closest friend. Closest friend. You are beautiful. Most beautiful. You are beautiful. One more time, one more time. Sing, dearest Father. You are my closest friend. You are beautiful. You are, you are. One more, one more. We call you, dearest Father. Lord, you were my closest friend. Sing, light of the world, you step down into darkness. Open your eyes, let me see the beauty that makes this heart. I told you, all of a life spent with it. For here I am to worship, here I am to bow down, here I am to say that you're my God, you're all 
Just lift your hands to him.
worship. I bring it to you, Father, for from you are all things, and to you are all things. You deserve the glory. the name of the Lord today. Father, we bless your name. We bless your name. We pray that you are worthy of it all. Good morning, good morning. Whatever time it is that you're joining from, I want to welcome you to ignite the, the, the prayer hour of the Elevation Church. What a joy, what a privilege to be able to lead us in prayer this powerful, powerful uh, Monday morning. I believe that God will begin a good work in us this year to step to perfect it in the precious name of the Lord Jesus. Uh, can I urge you this morning to lift your hands and just begin to bless the name of the Lord. Just bless the name of the Lord. Just bless the name of the Lord. And just appreciate him. Just thank him. Thank him. Thank him. Bless him. I appreciate him, Father. We thank you for your presence in our lives. We thank you for your goodness. We thank you for your mercy. Somebody who is glad to be in the presence of God today. Somebody who is glad uh, uh, to, 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 to celebrate Jesus today. I want us to just go ahead and bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him, and thank him. Bless him and thank him. Bless him and thank him. Say, Father, I'm grateful. Father, I'm grateful. Father, I'm grateful. Grateful for your goodness. Grateful for your mercy. Grateful for your compassion. We bless you. 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 You're worthy of it all, Father. You're worthy of it all. You're worthy of it all. You're worthy of it all. You're worthy of you of it all. For from you are all things, and to you are all things. And you deserve the glory. You deserve the honor. You deserve the adoration. We bless your name. 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 Glory be to Jesus. Glory be to Jesus. Uh, 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 this is a, a beautiful week. God, who started us out on a powerful note this year, uh, is committed to perfecting us that we have started in our life. What a time to be able to seek God. What a time to be able to honor God. Uh, I want to welcome each and every one of us uh, to this, this time in God's presence. I want to trust God uh, to reach and touch each and every one of us in a very powerful way uh, today. I believe that God will be done a good work in us. He will definitely definitely uh, perfecting. Praise God. Praise God. Praise Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. All right. Yeah. Can 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 you uh, can I know from Zoom if you can hear me now? Yeah. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? I know that everyone on. Okay. Okay. All right. Glory to God. Uh, I have to pray this morning. I just 
I just want to um to to start us out, you know, this this morning. I, I, I want to start us out this morning uh by just uh, uh sharing the word of God very, very briefly. I just want to share the word of God with us very briefly. Our prayer focus for this week is uh total healing and health. Total healing and health. Total healing and health. I want you to know that the will of God for you in 2024 is total, complete healing and health. In 2024, the will of God for you and I is total, complete healing and health. In 2024, the will of God for you and I is total healing and health. Somebody say after me this morning, uh, say in 2024, the will of God for me is total healing and health. I want to say one more time, in 2024, the will of God for me is total healing and health in the precious name of Jesus. Or oh, somebody shout a better amen. Uh, say it again, say in 2024, the will of God for you and I, I mean for me, personal life is just say for me, is total healing and health. Total healing and health. And that's what we're praying for this morning. We are sending words ahead of us, uh, trusting in God, the keeper, the one who is our keeper, the one who never sleeps, who never slumber. As we pray this morning, uh, words are going ahead of us into this new year. Uh, words of healing, words of soundness, words of divine health in the name of Jesus to guarantee that in 2024, I'm walking in the perfect will of God for me, which is total healing and health. Uh, First Thessalonians chapter 5, when you read verse 23 and 24, it says, Now may the God of all peace himself sanctify you completely. So may the God of all peace himself sanctify you completely. May your whole spirit, soul, and body be preserved blameless at the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. He who calls you is faithful, who will also do it. I love this prayer of the Apostle Paul to the uh, church of Thessalonica. He, he said, may the God of peace sanctify you. Uh, san san to sanctify there means to set apart, you know, to, to set as, as, as a vessel unto honor, to sanctify, to set apart, uh, to, to, you know, to, to clean up, to separate for himself. May the God of peace sanctify you completely. And he said, may your whole spirit, soul, and body be preserved blameless to the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. I want you to know this morning that this prayer of the Apostle Paul is the will of God for you and I, that consistently was, we, we are sanctified, set apart for God, for his purpose, and how can I be totally, completely set apart for the fulfillment of God's purpose? If I'm not in good health, if I'm not in sound mind, if, if, if my mind is not sound, if my health is not sound, if I'm not in, in enjoying soundness spiritually. So my prayer for somebody here today is that uh, uh, in 2024, you will be sound in the spirit. You will be sound in your mind and you will be sound in your body in the precious name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I say it again. I say you will be sound in the spirit. You will be sound in your mind and you'll be sound in your body, uh, in the precious name of the Lord Jesus Christ. And one thing is certain, all through the scripture, we see that our healing has been guaranteed because of the atonement that came from the blood of Christ. Yeah, when Christ hung on the cross, one of the things that became settled for you and I, one of the things that we procured uh, by sacrifice on the cross, is, is, is total healing and wholeness, total healing and wholeness. When Isaiah prophesied in Isaiah 53 about Christ, the coming of Christ, and uh, it, what Christ will do, it, it was essential, I mean, it's essential for you and I to understand that a major part of the work of redemption is redemption from sickness, redemption from disease, redemption from mental health illnesses, redemption, uh, uh, you know, uh, from 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 anything at all that is short of soundness, spirit, soul, and body. 
That was why Christ died. That was the reason why he died for you and Isaiah 53. Let's read it very quickly from verse 1. If anyone has believed our report, unto whom at the arm of the Lord being revealed, uh, he said, For it shall grow up before you as a tender plant. Isaiah 53, I'm reading verse 2. It shall grow up uh, before him as a tender plant and as a root out of the dry ground. He has, he has no form of all communities. And we see, and there's no beauty that we should desire. And he was just describing what Christ would go through, you know, uh, 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 on that road to God. But uh, verse 3 says, He is despised and rejected by men, a man of sorrow acquainted with grief. And we hear, as it were, our faces from him. Uh, they, you know, if you have watched the Passion of the Christ before, it's difficult to watch because of the violence unleashed on Christ because of you and I. Jesus could not have experienced that level of violence, and I will still be experiencing it right now because he, he took it on my behalf. His body was violated. His, his mind was assaulted. They spat on him. They said horrible words at him. And that was all done because of you and I for our redemption. Said he said, but still he says he is despised and rejected by men, a man of sorrow acquainted with grief, and we hid our, uh, uh, we hid as it were this is from him. He was despised, and we did not esteem him. Verse 4, that's where I'm going. He says, Surely he has borne our grief. Somebody said grief. He has borne my grief. He has borne, say it again, say he has borne my grief. He has borne my grief. Uh, say it loud. Let somebody hear you. Say he has borne my grief. Uh, and, and carry it my sorrow. Yet we are still in, we're stricken, smitten by God, and afflicted. Look at verse 5. But he was wounded for my transgression. Say with me this one. Say he was wounded for my transgression. Uh, say in 2024 and beyond, Christ has been wounded in advance for my transgression. He was bruised for my iniquities. Uh, uh, the chastisement of our peace was upon him, of my peace was upon him, and by his stripes I uh, was healed. I have been healed. By his stripes I have been healed. So uh, look at this. I, 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 you know, Isaiah chapter 53, verse 4 and verse 5 was very clear. Clear about the finished work of Christ on the cross of Calvary as far as my soundness, my wholeness, and my healing is concerned. And it's same for you that surely he has won my gifts. So somebody said 2024, uh, nothing grievous is permitted in my life. Uh, say I will have, say grief I will have no part in my life in the name of Jesus. Uh, say he has he has born, he has taken away my grief, he carried my sorrow. So in 2024, I wanted to declare sorrow. <laughs> And at eight shall be far from me, it shall be far from my family. I say it one more time. Say sorrow uh, and at eight shall be far from me and my family in the name of the Lord Jesus. Because Jesus was it was stricken, smitten, uh, uh, and afflicted. Uh, I will not be afflicted in this new year in the name of Jesus. The, the Bible says in verse five said he, he was wounded for my transgression. And bruise of my iniquities. In 2025 and 2024, I declare uh, that the price has already been paid for any iniquity or uh, for any transgression. So this year, I walk free of iniquity and transgression. I'm a righteous person. I, I, I walk in holiness. I live in righteousness. So I enjoy the peace of God consistently. Say it again, say, I enjoy the peace of God consistently. I enjoy the peace of God consistently. I enjoy the peace of God consistently. Say Christ was wounded for my transgression. He was bruised for my iniquity. Say the chastisement of my peace, the punishment for my peace was laid upon him. So in 2024, I enjoy the peace of God at home, at work, uh, in my neighborhood, within my extended family. I enjoy the peace of God in the name of the Lord Jesus. <laughs> and that is by stripes, by stripes we were healed. So I declare today that by the stripes of Jesus, I have been made whole. Say so sickness and diseases cannot, will not, be, shall not be able to rest on my body 
shall not be able to rest on my mind. In the name of the Lord Jesus, somebody shout it, believe in, amen. Oh, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. So lift your two hands to Jesus and begin to thank him. Begin to thank him. Begin to thank him. Thank him for your healing. Thank him for your wholeness. Thank him for your healing. Thank him for your wholeness. Ah, the Bible says that. Uh, uh, that, that the prayer of the Apostle Paul. Now, may the God of peace himself sanctify you completely and may your spirit, soul, and body be preserved blameless at the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. First Thessalonians 5 and verse 23, the God of all peace is sanctifying me, is making me whole. He has made me whole and I receive the full manifestation of it in this new year. No sickness is permitted to hang around me. Uh, no depression, no mental health situation. Uh, Jesus carried by me, he bore by me, and carried by sorrows. In the name of Jesus, I receive the manifestations of the word of God in my life in this new year. So I forbid grief, I forbid sorrow. In the name of Jesus, lift your voice right now. I begin to speak to God. I forbid grief. I forbid sorrow within my family. In the name of Jesus, the Bible says the voice of celebration and rejoicing shall be heard in the tabernacle of the righteous. I wanted to declare this morning, in this new year, only the voice of celebration, the voice of rejoicing shall be heard in my tabernacle. I forbid sorrow. I forbid grief. In the name of Jesus, La Prande de Kosuto Yende, La Kondo Prende Nankate, Ragata Kararabohe, E Pradu Kosuso. Somebody lift your voice, lift your voice, lift your voice. If you're still struggling with sleep or struggling to wake up, this is the time where you shake yourself off, off the bed, off wherever you are. The couch, rise on your feet and begin to walk around. If you're taking a walk at this time, don't be distracted. Focus on the prayer and begin to declare. Jesus has carried my grief, bore my grief, uh, and carried my sorrow. In the name of Jesus, in 2024, I declare today that I'm living free, living free of sorrow, living free of grief. Whatever grace we have shall not be my portion in 2024. Somebody lift your voice this morning and declare it, declare it, declare it. Ropra daka to prende de kisho topra ege lekete rakata karada nabosh preko to susu to prende de kisheta ya leka daka takara de kisheta yende leka doko susu topa e prende kete leka doko shuto. Somebody declare it one more time. Declare it one more time. Soul of heart. We uh, shall not be my portion in 2024. The voice of celebration, the voice of rejoicing shall continually be heard in my tabernacle. In the name of Jesus, the voice of celebration, the voice of rejoicing shall continually be heard in my home. In the name of Jesus, no sorrow, no grief, wholeness, wholeness, wholeness. In the name of Jesus, Lebra Nicate, Ye Prando Lopranda, Nica Tasati Corobosha, Alla Prande Nega City Yeni. Somebody declare wholeness one more time. 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 In the name of Jesus, Lebra Denga, A Prande Nega Soto, Ye Pradaka Tuso, Era Dega Sota, Rakatuko Soso to Prandi, Ye Pradoko Sutu, E Prodoko Soso. Reka take a sisi, na karada garada, ye kraduko shutu, ye karada gasusu, peleke, marada garaduko susu, marada gasusu to predege sheta, ye kradiki, marada gasutu, marada gasusu, maraduko susu, marada kasete kedia, rakasusu to kradogobosha, maraduko susu to predege shete, ye de krede kede dike sheta, marada gasusu to predege shata ya. Ebra dike shata ta dike shite kere dike shata pa ye kere dike shita yani lakundo koro doko soto arada kasuso to pre dike shite na kasudo marado kusuto mirende leke tike sisi teka landa doko soso to pre dike shita yani in the precious name of the Lord Jesus, I decree one more time today that 2024, the voice of celebration, the voice of rejoicing shall be heard in your house. No grief, no sorrow. No grief, no sorrow. No grief, no sorrow. Holy Son, Allah, the God of peace, 
will sanctify you uh, completely. May your spirit, soul, and body be preserved blameless at the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Somebody shout of believing, amen. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Uh, uh, still, still in the attitude of prayer, I want us to uh, declare as we thank God this year for his gift of perfect health. Uh, that has been given to his children. Uh, I, I wanted to understand some that healing, the scripture says, is children's bread. Uh, you know, Matthew chapter 15, when you read from verse 20, 20, 20, uh, 20, 25, or Matthew, Matthew chapter 20, uh, Matthew chapter 15, from verse 25, you, you read the story of the Canaanite woman uh, who came to meet Jesus and, you know, and treated him. Uh, to, to heal her, her, her daughter who, who was uh, grievously vexed, you know, and, and Jesus you know, looked at the woman and said, uh, what is meant for the children cannot be cast, you know, away uh, to, to the dogs. And uh, the woman uh, insisted uh, that what, uh, you know, even if it's not meant for the dog, but something can fall for, from the table that the dog will be able to partake of. This woman did not mind whatever name uh, she, 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 she was called, you know, or anything like that, or whatever insinuation, she just pressed in. She just pressed in. I wanted to lift your voice this morning. Say in 2024, I pressed into healing, I pressed into restoration, I pressed into redemption. In the name of Jesus, uh, at any critical point, uh, the word that I need that will bring healing, what I need to say that will bring my healing will come to me in the name of the Lord Jesus. Uh, the same way the woman, you know, the Bible says in verse 25, after Jesus said, uh, I was sent except to the lost sheep. Uh, I, was, I was not sent except to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Then she came and worshipped him saying, Lord, help me. Uh, 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 for the answer, it is not good to take the children's bread and throw it to the to little dog. And she said, yes, Lord. Yet even the little dogs eat the crumbs with pork from the master's table. Then Jesus answered and said, oh woman, great is your faith. Let it be unto you as you desire. And her daughter was ill that very hour. Uh, there are two things we want to pray for from here. One is that this year we will not operate like outsiders. We will operate like insiders. Healing is children's bread. So this year you will not bend for healing. Healing will come to you freely. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus, give me revelation knowledge about your, my, your provision for my healing and for my redemption for my for my entire family. So this year I decree and declare. Uh, that the world of sickness is broken over my family. In the name of Jesus, we press into the provision that has been made for us. It's like when you buy bread and put in the fridge, and your children are now looking for bread all around the house, but there's bread in the house. Healing is children's bread. This year, uh, everyone within my family will enjoy healing in the name of Jesus. They will find it in the word of God. They will find it by revelation. They will press it. I want to begin to declare it in the name of Jesus. Father, send your word to my house. So the Bible says he sent his word and healed them and delivered them from all their destructions. Somebody declared that thing. Father, send your word into my household. Send your word into my family. Send your word into my business. Send your word. Send your word. Send your word. Send your word to my spouse. Send your word to my children. Send your word to my parents. In the name of Jesus, in 2024, as for me and my house, we are living in wholeness. We are enjoying supernatural health, supernatural healing, and wholeness. In the name of Jesus, my lake and all, we will not lose sight of the bread that is already provided. In the name of the Lord Jesus, my lepre de catoso suto prende de gasha, le carande de pito, racuto suso to, the curse of sickness is broken. In the name of Jesus, it was broken on the cross, it remains broken over me and my household. I want to declare right now, in the name of Jesus, the curse of sickness, which was broken on the cross, remains broken over me and my household. La coto prende, Galatians 3 and 13, Carada da Shatayanda, 
Christ has redeemed us from the curse of the law, for it is written, curse of everyone found on the tree, uh, Aradakata, Yakatusu Suto Prende, Yakatusu Suto Predator, is that the blessing of Abraham may come upon the Gentile. So we declare this morning the curse of sickness, the curse of barrenness, Maradikusu Suto Prada, the curse of mental health sickness, the curse of delayed speech, but whatever it is, whatever it is, it is it, 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 it is broken. It has been broken on the cross. And this year it manifests fully within me and my family in the name of Jesus. Let that be the prayer of your heart right now. Declare, let the devil hear you. Sickness, disease, you are not permitted in my household. You are not permitted in my body. You are not permitted in my mind. You are not permitted. La carto sosoto in my soul. La kondo prende neke sita yami. La grande de kito koso. 2024. I enjoy sanctification unto God. Separation unto God for his use. So my body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. It cannot harbor sickness. It cannot harbor a virus. It shall not harbor a virus. It shall not harbor bacterial infections. In the name of Jesus, la kondo prende neka teka sise teka langre de kesata yekanda la kata rakoso soto prende neka shita yande le kondo prende neka sata. I want us to switch gear right now. Somebody begin to declare a specific uh, the issues that are prevalent in your family. Somebody listen to me right now. I have an impression in my spirit. This is the time that God wants to set you free of, 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 of menstrual pain in the name of Jesus. God is setting you free of menstrual pain in the name of Jesus. Malako to Susu to Predeka Shita Yande. Ah, I hear that in my spirit. The hand of God is coming upon someone right now and you'll receive your deliverance from mental pain, menstrual pain. Pain is not your portion. Jesus carried your grief. Uh, he bore your pain and he, he, and carried your grief. Ah, Lakuto Susoto, whatever is grievous to your body, grievous to your mind, grievous to your spirit, Jesus paid the price for it. And I wanted to declare right now, right now, right now, I'm, I'm free. I wanted to begin to mention different things, just like I mentioned menstrual pain. Whatever you're putting used to, uh, that Christ has paid for, it's time to reject them. You know, there are some things we have gotten used to. Some people will just say, you know, at this part of a particular time in the home, this migraine headache just comes for like three days and then it will go again. Or at this part, at the part of the month, you know, uh, uh, this, uh, this, 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 uh, the, you know, uh, this fever just comes and it goes again. I mean, for people living abroad, there's a flu season and it looks like everybody must have flu. Uh, but that must be except me. It must be except you. In the name of Jesus, this winter season, for everyone turning from the West, whatever characterizes winter negatively, it will not happen to you and your family. There shall be no falling this season. You will not fall and break a bone. You will not fall and hurt yourself. In the name of Jesus, no accident this season that will anything that will cause grief. Jesus already paid for it, so I wanted to declare it in the name of Jesus, winter or no winter. I am sound. And they said depression goes up during winter. I want to reject it. In the name of Jesus, my mind is free of, uh, of depression. In the name of Jesus, whatever part of the world we are in right now, whatever the weather situation may be there, I want to declare Jesus paid for my wholeness. I look at the Qatar, wherever I am in the world. The price is paid, whether winter or summer or, or, or spring, whatever time. The price is paid. I will not suffer what the world suffer because I'm born in Christ. And when any man is in Christ, he's a new creature because he's redeemed. So I am redeemed from sickness. I am redeemed from depression. I am redeemed. Somebody declare, 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 declare. I will not get used to what I should reject. I will not get used to what has been paid for. Some people are getting used to what they should reject. Oh, I want somebody to lift your voice. Whatever allergy that you're already getting used to. Ah, if I hit this, this is what is going to happen. 
a la cop of friendly, somebody dealing with lactose intolerance, if they are going from when you are young, a rather a higher, I need to declare this morning, when revelation comes to you, that's when you start living the fullness of in Christ. If it's when revelation of Christ comes to you that you start to live the fullness of Christ, I don't care how long that situation has been there. It is when revelation comes to you and you start living in the fullness of Christ. I want to declare I received the revelation of Christ concerning that allergy this year. Uh, that allergy will not survive in my body. In the name of Jesus, I want to begin to declare it. Declare it right now. Jesus. Marando Rodo Cusso Suto Prende Lekasita, Rakuto Prende Lekasita, Ala Mataya. I reject everything that Christ has paid for that wants to remain in my body and remain in my life. In the name of Jesus, I will not allow any excuse. I will not allow any excuse. The Canaanite woman in, in Matthew chapter 15, uh, even though she did not qualify, she pressed into healing. If she could press into healing that she was not qualified for, Jesus said, We cannot give children's bread to dogs. She said, I don't mind crumbs. We, we are, our case is not crumbs. Uh, we qualify for healing. So we cannot be managed. We must press into what we qualify for. We must press into what we qualify for. Yes, yes, yes. We must press into what we qualify for. Uh, in Luke 13, you know, you, you, you read the story of a woman who was who, who, who had been bound and bent over. Uh, and Jesus looked at that woman in verse 16 of Luke 13. Ought not this woman, ought not this woman, ought not this woman. That was what he said. Ought not this woman. He was asking a question. Ought not this woman, <laughs> being a daughter of Abraham, who had been bent over, uh, I mean, who had, uh, whom Satan had bound low these 18 years, be looped from this bondage, even on Sabbath day? Jesus was saying, if you are willing to press in, God is willing to do it, even on Sabbath day, the day that was supposed to be a day of rest. And Jesus was confronting the, the authority of the day. Or ought not this woman, being a daughter of Abraham, and I'm speaking to a woman here this, this time, uh, somebody on this platform, a man on this platform, ought not this man, being a son of Abraham, by the finished work of Christ on the cross of Calvary, according to Galatians 3 and 13, you being a daughter of Abraham, being a son of Abraham, uh, uh, whatever bondage of the devil, said, whom Satan has bound, think of it, for 18 years, be loose. From this bond of Sabbath day, ah, somebody this this time, I want to press into what Christ was saying here. Uh, you know, things that have been provided for us needs are uh, pressing in. That's what we're praying this week. Uh, uh, I believe between now and the invitation service on Saturday, somebody you already you are coming to invitation service to give your testimony. You are not coming to be prayed for again because you will be already completely healed in the name of Jesus, whether physically or online. By the time you show up on Saturday at the invitation service, you are healed completely in the name of Jesus. I want you to lift your voice right now and begin to press in. Say, I am a son or a daughter of Abraham. I press into my healing. I rebuke the bonding. Mention the name of the thing and I rebuke it. Ah, you know, except we're pressing forcefully, some things we will not hear and leave. We press in this morning. Ought not this man be the son of Abraham? Ought not this woman be the daughter of Abraham? Be loose from this plan for bondage. Ah, this 18 years. I don't care how many years. Uh, it's not about the year, it's about when the revelation comes to you that you qualify for healing, that you are a daughter of Abraham, that you are a son of Abraham in Christ. And I want to declare this morning in the name of Jesus, I uh, mention the situation and say, I press into my healing. Mention someone's name. You know, in the Bible, you see many people who press in, who press in. People carry, I mean, you remember the story of the four guys who carried their friends and tore the roof and pressed into healing. The man had no faith by himself, but because of his friend, 
Jesus said, perhaps when Jesus saw the faith, the faith of his friend, he, 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 he spoke to the man who was impotent, said, carry your bed and go. Uh, I wanted to pray this morning. You are praying for someone right now. I want to put yourself in the shoes of those four, four men who carry that person. I want to mention somebody's name right now and begin to speak healing over them. Begin to speak healing over them. It doesn't have to be a terminal sickness. It is wholeness we are praying for this time around. Somebody who suffers something periodically. Somebody who has been dealing with asthma for so long. Sickness and anemia for so long. I want to mention their name today. I'm going to declare over their life in intercession the next two, three minutes. Just declare over their life. Healing and health. Healing and health. Wholeness will press into their healing. Mention the situation and rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Lakondo Peketeya, Sakanta Yakara, Dikesheta. Somebody mentioned that name, Sarah, and rebuke that, that arthritis in the name of Jesus. Say on behalf of Sarah, I rebuke arthritis right now in the name of Jesus. Lakondo Center, on behalf of uh, uh, Adewale, I rebuke the effect of sickle cell anemia. I decree that your blood is healed. In the name of Jesus, uh, there's nothing that God cannot do. Your blood is healed of sickle cell anemia. In the name of Jesus, somebody mention someone's name and rebuke the cancer. In the name of Jesus, it doesn't matter where the cancer is. Cancer in the breast, cancer in the colon, cancer in the esophagus, wherever the cancer is, I want you to rebuke it right now. In the name of Jesus, la koto prende de kishata, hold it, hold it, hold it. Present into our healing this season in the name of Jesus. La Kondo Prede Kesa, Yegra Data Lakata, Ro Corona Bosha, Recruito Prende, Nangra de Kesese Te Kalano, Yekere de Seta, Ought not this woman, Ought not this man, uh, being a child of Abraham. Uh, the devil has held down this five years, this three years, this 20 years, this 40 years. You are loose in the name of Jesus. La Kondo Prede Kesa, Rakata Karande. Somebody declare over that person, declare over that sickness, say enough is enough, we press into what Christ paid for. Enough is enough, we press into what Christ paid for. Declare enough is enough, we press into what Christ paid for. In the name of Jesus, enough is enough, we press into what Christ paid for. In the name of Jesus, la crono prende neke shita arada gataya rakuso suto ere neke sisi. Yes, mention that Bible and declare it in the name of the Lord Jesus. Rakuto suso to enough is enough. We rebuke Bible. We command you to go melt away in the name of Jesus. Melt away in the name of Jesus. La crono suso to pra elekete rakuto prende ne prende ne kata suto ere neke te la crono prende neke shete. A redegate, your cradic sutoya, a predicata suso to predeca suto, a rando la coso suto. Yes, sir, I stand against that lupus in the name of Jesus. Maranda Catuso, whatever attacks your body from inside your body, whatever is attacking organs in your body, we rebuke it this morning in the name of the Lord Jesus. Maranda Lake Seta, Jesus Christ makes you whole. Jesus Christ makes you whole. Jesus Christ makes you whole. In the name of Jesus. La canto su su to prende de kesha. En le gete. Re kete kede. Re kete kede. Ra kuto prende ne ke shite yene. Ra kata para da da santa. I pe di ke si se te. Ra kuto prende la kuto su su to. En re de gete. Le ke di ke shite yene. La para da da ba. Re kete nda. Sakata. Somebody speak. Over that depression. Speak over that mental health situation and declare right now in the name of Jesus, Lakoto Susu Tope Deke Shite Yende. That spirit of heaviness is rebuked and we command you, go in the name of Jesus. Uh, the Bible says in 1 Peter 2 and 24, he said, For our sin in his body on the tree that we have died to sin, but live righteous in righteousness, by whose stripes you were healed. We declare this money by a strife we have been here in the name of Jesus. La Koro Dupu Kusu Suto Predenke Takalagataya, Rakuto Predenke Lekate, Rakata Kasu Suto Predenke Gese, Ye Granda Lagata, Rekoto Suso, E Predenke Lekate, So Suto Predenke Lekito Suso Takadani, and the Nokota, E Predenke Take a Shit Yeni, Rakataya, in the name of the Lord Jesus. In the name of the Lord Jesus, somebody shouted the meaning, Amen. 
Oh, somebody shouted better. Amen. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. We're still praying. We're still praying right now. I want you to appropriate the same word that works for physical healing. Uh, physical healing in the body to every other area where healing is needed right now. Uh, right now. I wanted to appropriate the same word to every other area where healing is needed. Healing may be needed in your marriage. Healing may be needed in your finances. Some people need to speak to a business that is humorating money. Money is flowing in, but we can't find it. It is humorage, but this time around, it's not physical blood, but it is financial resources. I want you to lift your voice right now and begin to speak healing, wholeness, and redemption into every area, every area, every area, every area, every area where healing is needed. I want you to begin to declare it right now, begin to declare it right now, begin to declare it right now. Mention those areas and just declare it in the name of Jesus. I wanted to declare that in the name of Jesus, Aradike Sete, the healing power of God flows into this area of my life. Declare that area and declare that the healing power of God is flowing into that area in the name of the Lord Jesus. Rakuto Sosoto Prende Nekashita, Ye Kradanga Leketo Suso, Erede Geleke, Leke Dike Suso, Erede Kasata, Rekoto Sosoto Prende Nekashite. The healing power of God flows into that area in the name of Jesus. La Kondo Prende Neke Tekesata, Ye Tanda Nagata, Rakanto Susoto Prende Neke Shita Yande, La Kata Karanda. Mention that area right now. Whether it is finance, whether it is business, uh, whether it, 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 whatever it is, uh, uh, marriage, I want to declare the healing power of God flows into my home, uh, 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 heals my marriage. Somebody, whatever it is, just begin to declare, just begin to declare right now. Appropriate the same power of healing into every other area apart from physical body. There is nothing that the power of God cannot heal. And I want to declare right now, healing stream is flowing right now. Lakuto, Prende, Lake Sheta, healing waters everywhere. Let it flow to the different areas. Let it flow to the different areas. Mention them right now. And declare it, let it flow, let it flow. It flows, it flows, it flows into the different areas. In the name of Jesus, Marande Ketosu Suto Prende Ne Kashata, Le Kadakata, start to appropriate the healing power of Jesus. It flows to your career path. Uh, getting a job, losing it, and coming back and losing it, and then they are pushing you back. And supposed to be a senior manager, uh, a middle level manager, what you have left behind is what they are giving you to do. Your career path needs the healing touch of God, uh, healing and wholeness, so you can be where God wants you to be. I want you to begin to declare healing and wholeness in every other area of life. The same God that heals our body. Is the same God that heals our finances and heals our marriages and heals our other important relationships. I want to just begin to declare right now the hand of God is upon my life. The healing power of God is appropriated into the different areas of my life in the name of Jesus. Marando Predica Sisete in this new year. I enjoy wholeness, wholeness, wholeness in different areas of life. Wholeness in the name of Jesus. Marande le kito soso. Every day kato soso to preden kalanka take a shite. Ye kodo kobo. Aradagata. Preketen to prende nende suto yende. E kondo predika shata. Le kodo kosoto. E rede de suto prende. Lo kodo kotopa. E prende kate. Somebody pray in the Holy Ghost. Pray in understanding. Pray in the Holy Ghost. Pray in understanding. Appropriate the word of healing. Uh, Appropriate every word of healing. Let the healing revelation come to you concerning different areas of life in the name of the Lord Jesus. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. And we give you glory. We give you praise. We give you glory and we give you praise. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. Lakoto Susoto Predekashata Marande Nekito Ekredekashatada. Thank you, everlasting Father. In the precious name of the Lord Jesus. I want us to take these declarations together right now. Right now, I want to prepare as we take these declarations. I want us to say these things after me. 
boldly, as we declare them, boldly, 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 boldly. Uh, I wanted to prepare to make this bold declaration in the name of the Lord Jesus. Somebody say after me, say in the name of Jesus, uh, say in the name of Jesus, I declare uh, that I'm a child of God uh, uh, and his healing power flows through my veins. By the stripes of Jesus, I declare that I'm healed from every sickness and every disease. Say it again, say by the stripes of Jesus, I declare that I'm healed from every sickness and every disease. Say I declare what God's word says about me in Psalm 103 and verse number three. Uh, say he forgives all my diseases and heals all my diseases. Say it again, say he forgives. For forgives all my iniquities. This is Psalm 103 and verse number three. Uh, say that after me, say he forgives all my iniquities uh, and he heals all my diseases. Uh, say he redeems my life score from destruction. He redeems my life from destruction. He crowns me with loving kindness and tender mercy. Say it again, say he crowns me with loving kindness and tender mercies. Say, God, my God, satisfies uh, uh, my mouth with good things so that my youth is renewed like the eagle. Say, verse 5 with me one more time. Say, the Lord, my God, satisfies my mouth with good things. Uh, say, this season, uh, I will not eat bad things. I will not eat things that will hurt my body. In the name of Jesus, say my mouth will not sabotage the health of my body. Say in the name of Jesus, my mouth and my appetite will not sabotage my health. In the name of Jesus, say that to me one more time. Say my mouth, uh, my appetite will not sabotage the, my health. Say Jesus paid for my health, uh, so he satisfies my mouth with good things. Uh, my youth is renewed like the eagle. Say, I'm, I cannot be weak. I'm strong all of the time because Jesus paid the price for my strength, my wholeness, and my peace. Somebody say, again, say, Jesus paid the price for my strength, my wholeness, and my peace. And I stand on his promises. Say, I walk by faith and not by sight. Regardless of whatever I see or feel, I trust in the healing power of God. Say one more time, say, regardless of what I see or what the doctor says or what I feel, I walk and I trust in the healing power of God. Uh, say, my body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. It is a dwelling place for divine health. In the name of Jesus, I say, in the name of Jesus, say it again, say, in the name of Jesus, I take authority over every sickness. And infirmity, I command uh, pain to leave, and I release the healing power of God into every cell, tissue, and organs in my body. Say it again, say, I command pain to leave, and I release the healing power of God into every cell, every tissue, and every organ in my body. In the name of Jesus, uh, I declare that I am whole in body, in soul, and in spirit. Every part of my being aligns with the perfect health that God intends for me. Sickness have no place in my life. In the name of Jesus, somebody who believe that shall be believing. Amen. Glory be to God, glory be to God, glory be to God, glory be to God. Uh, 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 I just want to urge you this, 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 this time to just believe every word that we have declared. You know, Isaiah 3 and verse number 1, he said, Who has believed our report? Unto whom is the hand of God being revealed? Who has believed our report? If you believe the report of the Lord, you will see the hand of God. Uh, 
I decree over you from this January, you will begin to see the hand of God as you begin to believe the report of the Lord. Uh, this year, nothing will change your mind. You will continue to believe the report of the Lord. Somebody here, I decree over you this morning, faith comes into your heart to believe the report of the Lord much more than the report of the doctor. The report of the doctor talks about what is happening. The report of the Lord talks about what is written. What is written will always supersede what is happening. What is written will overcome and override what is happening. Don't focus on what is happening. Focus on what is written. Who has believed our report? The report of the word of God was written yeah, thousands of years ago, the doctor wrote your report last year. Which one is more important? The one that has worked for thousands of years or the one they just wrote last week or last year or two years ago? In the name of Jesus, I will pray right now. Faith enters into your heart to believe the report of the Lord. You, the report of the doctor will no longer make you cry. I think in the name of the Lord Jesus, uh, you will walk by faith and not by sight. You will not walk by feeling. You may be feeling something in your body, but please continue to believe and declare the report of the Lord concerning your health. And so you shall see the hand of the Lord. Who are believed our report? Unto whom the hand of God is being revealed. The hand of God will be revealed in your life. It shall be revealed in your family. It will be revealed in your household. This season, in the name of Jesus, the arm of the Lord is not short sure that he will not be able to touch you. I decree the, the, the outstretched hand of the Lord over you and your family. In the name of Jesus, the outstretched hand of the Lord over you and your household. In the name of Jesus, Father, we thank you and we bless your holy name. We give you glory and we give you praise. In the precious name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Somebody shout it, believe it. Amen. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. Father, we thank you. Okay, right now, before we wait, we, 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 just the last five minutes of our time together, if you have any uh, uh, testimonies, I want you to please go ahead and put it in the comments or, or uh, whatever platform you are on. If you are on uh, on uh, Zoom, please go to Q&A and drop uh, uh, your testimonies there. If you don't mind, please go to Q&A and just write testimonies and put it there. On every other platform, just go to comment and drop your testimonies there. And as we do that, drop your testimony. If you have any other special prayer point that we haven't prayed about, I want to go ahead and put it there. Yeah, I see your prayer points on Zoom, uh, 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 visa appointment, uh, you know, uh, it, uh, favor, different things. I'm going to pray about them now in the last few minutes, but I want to, I wanted to also let's celebrate God for what God has done by putting our testimonies also on these platforms. Uh, right now, right now, if you have YouTube, have a testimony. Thank you. Some people are already dropping their testimonies on YouTube. Please go ahead and drop them. Uh, uh, when we said on YouTube, I joined Tech in 2023 and suddenly realized that severe and extreme pain, uh, painful back cervical spondylosis for over eight years is gone. I can't explain this. Days of crying because of pain. Uh, praise the Lord. Cervical spondylosis gone and gone forever. We celebrate God in your life, honey, and we believe that God who began this good work of healing, He will perfect it in your life and in your family. In the precious name of the Lord Jesus. Uh, 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 Elizabeth on YouTube also said, uh, Testimony, testimony, BG just prayed over menstrual pain. And immediately, I immediately came into it and claimed it. I felt relieved almost immediately to the glory of God. That menstrual pain is not coming back in the name of Jesus. The God who healed you and gave you this relief will perfect the healing completely in the name of the Lord Jesus. Thank you, uh, uh, Elizabeth, for sharing this, this testimony. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, uh, somebody... Uh, 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 another uh, testimony. Uh, I'll read one or two more testimonies. Uh, um, uh, and uh, uh, somebody said, uh, testimony in Leon, he said, I prayed for a job, and the next day I started getting multiple job offers. Uh, 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 yes, multiple job offers. Uh, after praying for a job on this platform, he said, the next day I started getting multiple job offers. God will perfect what he has started and 
take you to the place of your testimony, career-wise, choosing the right job for you in the name of Jesus. Also, uh, uh, Kola on the on Zoom says, indeed, my father is a prayer answering God. At the uh, beginning of the fast forward, my heart desire is to get a job, and I told God, my job will come this January because my contract with the previous company I was working for had expired. And God did it. On Monday, 8th of January, I was invited for a virtual interview. And on Thursday of the same week, my congratulatory mail came in. I blessed uh, my God. Surely I'm sorry on April Street. Usola, you call out God will perfect what is certain. He will continue to soar on April Street in the name of Jesus. He will favor you on this new job in Jesus' name. The testimonies are, are increasing rapidly. Uh, so, uh, so he said, uh, my business was nominated by my bank and was rewarded with one million on Saturday morning. Praise the Lord. Thank God uh, for that testimony. Uh, another testimony, anonymous. I want to thank God for getting me into uh, uh, master's and providing, into a master's degree program and providing the funds. We celebrate God for that. Um, uh, uh, another testimony on Zoom. Sir PG has declared marital settlement and this happening. Uh, men has lined up to propose marriage. I want to thank God because this has never happened since I was born again. I just want to thank God. Somebody said, now I'm getting married proposals. It has never happened since I became born again. And that's where I've declared it this year. She has started getting married proposals. God who began this good work in this person's life, it will make it go around. Your own testimony of marital settlement will be the next one. And everyone, God, I mean, every good testimony that God will bring into your life, this city, I decree in the name of Jesus, it will perfect it in the precious name of the Lord Jesus. Now we're going to start to pray over every prayer point. I see one more testimony. He said, I asked for, for a contract six months ago, and I prayed daily on this platform. My approval came on Friday evening. I promised to come back uh, to tell uh, it on this platform. It, it wasn't there. Someone mentioned my name in a room where uh, he said I wasn't there. Someone mentioned my name in a room uh, uh, where I was I wasn't present. Just as we have been praying on this platform. Thank you, Jesus. And thank you, my family, for my vow to the Lord and the video. Praise the Lord. I want to stretch out your hand towards every platform right now and begin to declare. Begin to declare in the name of the Lord Jesus, that every test, I mean, the, we thank God for every testimony, but we speak over every prayer point. I want to pray in the spirit and pray in understanding, speaking over every prayer point. I'm going to declare in the name of Jesus, the hand of the Lord rests upon every prayer point. In the name of Jesus, every testimony that I've been shared this morning, we use them as point of contact with people looking for a job, people trusting God for healing, people trusting God for approval, people talking, trusting God for documents to come, people trusting God uh, uh, for business breakthrough, for favor, for financial breakthrough. We receive the hand of God upon every prayer point right now. Please declare, just two more minutes, declare over every prayer point on Zoom, every prayer point on uh, Mixella, every prayer point on YouTube, every prayer point on Instagram. We decree in the name of Jesus, divine provision, the hand of God rests upon you and your household. In the name of Jesus, Marande Kosuso to predate a shelter, ye plan your Rodoko Suso to pray the letter Sisete, Rakata Karadaga, ye for Doko Rodobosha, Reke to Kosoto Pranga, Neka Shiti Yende, Arada Gasanta, every testimony on Instagram, our breakthroughs that God has given people, we have proclaimed them this morning and declared in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, Marandro Rodoko Suso to predate a shepe, Maradaka Suso to pray in the we decree God multiply this testimony. People are seeking testimony of overcoming delay on Instagram of, of reason through uh, you know qualifications, international qualifications with great success. We we ask Father, we replicate this testimony uh, on every prayer point 
that has been put on this altar, on Instagram, on Zoom, on MixLR, on YouTube, in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray the Holy Ghost one more minute. La Crande, Neko, Toso, Soto, Pranga, Nanka, Take a Shete, Legre, Neketa, Sopra, Daka, Taya, Aranda, Lakata, Kasata, Roko, Soto, Prende, Neke, Shete, Yende, Langla, Neka, Taka, Sese, Teka, Rande, Marita, Settlement, La Kondo, Predika, Shete, Yanda, La Kataya, Healing, Manifesting with Speed. Rakoto praying the neck sheta, restoration of mind, healing of children. Lakota praying the neck sheta, delay terminated in the name of Jesus. Supernatural provision. Rakasusu to predict a sheta yanda. La grande de kite keta. Ara de kete kelea. Rakota praying the neck and take a susu to predict. 30 more seconds. Declare the word of the Lord. Declare the hand of God over every prayer point. In the name of Jesus, we declare the hand of the Lord over every prayer point. In the name of Jesus, Rakoto Prendi Neka Sita Yanda Lakata, Rokoto Prendi, Akrondo Koto Predekata, Ethan Yakusa. In the name of the Lord Jesus, Father, we thank you and we bless your name. So we declare, Father, according to your word, that your outstretched hand comes upon every prayer request. We declare that this prayer request are turned into death in peace. In the name of Jesus, Father, you who stay in secret, reward openly. Prove yourself as a prayer answering God in the life of your people. In the name of the Lord Jesus, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you for every prayer point that has been raised on this altar today. We declare that they have turned into a testimony in the precious name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Father, we bless your holy name. We give you glory and we give you praise for great and mighty things that you have done. For this, we are grateful. We are grateful. Somebody who is grateful, lift your hands and bless the name of the Lord before you go today, celebrating and blessing. Just say, Father, we are grateful. Father, we are grateful. Grateful, grateful, grateful for your goodness. Grateful for your mercy. Grateful for your goodness. Grateful for your mercy. We bless your holy name in the name of the Lord Jesus. So please don't forget, we want to send in those testimonies. Uh, testimonies at the Elevation Engine of ORG. If you can record them on video and send them through way transfer uh, to testimonies at the Elevation Engine of ORG, we will appreciate it. Testimonies, plural, at the Elevation Engine of ORG. Please send your testimonies in as they come. We would love to use them to encourage other people. And uh, don't forget to pray every morning. This is the last week of our Fast Forward Prayer Campaign, which we are brought into Ignite every morning, 6 a.m. West African time. And also in the evening, through our small groups, we are praying in different small groups. And on Wednesdays, we pray physically at different locations, which is also transmitted online. And on Saturday, Today, the grand finale of our impartation services that I've been holding every Saturday. This Saturday is about administration, physical healing and health, impartation, and then family, uh, uh, you know, restoration, and marital settlement. I need you to come in, if you can, to any of our physical center this Saturday. It promises to be a power pack experience, a life transforming experience. Uh, I pray for you that the presence of God will abide with you and your family this week. Nothing missing, nothing broken in your life. Go with grace and return with testimonies in the precious name of Jesus. May you receive good news this week on your job. Good news, good news, good news. That project is working out well. Everything is planning out well. Jesus is glorified. Solutions are coming for issues uh, that have been pending. Solutions are coming for issues that have been pending. Solutions are coming for issues that are depending in the name of Jesus. God bless you, everyone. I'll see you uh, tomorrow on Ignite at 6 uh, a.m. West African time. If you're joining us on Instagram, you can join us on Elevation NG on YouTube tomorrow to continue with us on, on, on Ignite. My wife, Pastor Bolan Rakinski, will be uh, leading prayers tomorrow on YouTube. Elevation ending so if you're on Instagram, you can join us there tomorrow. God bless you and have a great week, everyone, and continue to bless in the glory of God. And may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit abide with you now and forevermore in Jesus' precious name. God bless you all. God bless you all. Have a great week. Have a great week. And God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you all. Have a great week. Bye, everyone. God bless you. God bless you. Please give my love to your family and have a fantastic week. God bless you. God bless you.